so easy to use. It's just kind of a no-brainer, honestly. Today, I'm with Stephen, who's an independent consultant within real estate mergers. Stephen, thank you for joining me. Happy to be here. First, please tell me a little bit about your business. So I work with brokerages all over the United States and uh, help them with their succession planning or their growth strategies if they want to buy other brokerages or sell their brokerage. And um, I also consult with them just on general growth, but mostly in the mergers and acquisitions uh, sector of their business. That sounds very interesting. Tell me how Picture is helping you with that. So I uh, work in the real estate business, but the consulting is something that I'm building on the side. And it was important to build uh, some clout and also a library of content. And so Pictory has been great with taking some of my blog content or even some AI generated content and turning into little videos. Uh, and, you know, I keep them relatively short, maybe three or four minutes, probably five or six at the most. I put them on YouTube and I share them on LinkedIn and it just starts to build that uh, credibility and people say, oh, he, he actually knows what he's talking about. This content's very useful. And some of my content is agent facing like tips on lead generation or whatever, but mostly it's about uh, brokers and, and their uh, their struggles, whether it be operational, whether it be growth. Uh, and so it's it just makes it so easy to take the content that I've generated or created myself and make it into something that's a little more digestible. So not everybody wants to read with their eyes. I don't personally like to. I like audiobooks or videos. So uh, it's very helpful uh, in that aspect. And it's just so easy to use. It's just kind of a no brainer, honestly. It's great that you can provide people with content in the way that they like to consume it. Some people like reading, some people like listening, and some people increasingly like to watch that content in video form. Can you tell me a little bit more about the workflow? Are you using our script to video function or are you using the article to video function? I've used both. <clears throat> so I've uh, mostly the script to video. So if it's, if it's a blog post that I've written, then I will just put the entire script in there and just let the let the system do its thing. Uh, I have also done the article ones where it's maybe not even my content, but it's a great article and I'll, I'll convert it and then I'll, I'll link to the original article. Uh, so I've, I've used both for the, um, the traditional video content. And when you've made the video and downloaded it, how do you deploy that asset? Generally, I will start it on YouTube uh, and then I will uh, share it out on social media. So LinkedIn, Facebook, things like that. The I try to do native uh, video, so I'll try to upload the video if I can directly instead of doing YouTube because, as we know, uh, you know Google uh, or Facebook and Google don't get along as much, so they don't generally love you putting YouTube videos on uh, Facebook. You don't get as much, uh, I guess, juice out of it. So I try to keep the videos native, so I'll upload them directly to social media. And have you found since using video through Pictory that your engagement levels have gone up on the social platforms? I believe they have. Uh, I've gotten uh, several uh, people reaching out to me for cons consultations, not directly saying I saw your video, but it was more of a, I've been looking at your content for months and I finally decided I wanted to reach out and talk to you. So it's really just a part of an overall content strategy. You know, I don't expect one video to, you know, be the magic bullet, but it it's sort of that library of content to say, oh wow, this is there's a lot of a lot of information on the topic. And so that it just helps build my credibility as a consultant. Certainly one of the key things with content marketing and video content marketing in particular is to be consistent. And you'll be surprised that people often think that they know you before they even reach out to you having watched video because video speaks to them in a way that other mediums don't. Absolutely. And, and the beauty of, uh, you know, like using something like chat GPT to create some of the content is I can make it sound like me. So it, a lot of people can't tell the difference between an article I actually wrote and published or, or an article that I had AI generate. And then I put it into picture cause it's not my voice. Uh, and, and so it doesn't really matter. Uh, people really don't know the difference. So are you using our AI voices to voice the scripts? I am, yes. Uh, actually, my favorite is named Heather. She's actually a British female voice. Um, for some reason, I just think that that sounds the best. Uh, I like the way she pronounces things. I also was using one of the Australian female voices as well. 
Uh, but Heather, I, I've kind of settled on as my favorite. Well, that's great. We've recently partnered with Eleven Labs, which is the best in the industry for AI voices. And uh, we find that people are getting really good results with those compared with some of the voices in our competitors' products. So I'm glad that you've, you've found those. I have a, a further question, if I may. If you were to talk to someone who'd never used Pictory before, what would you say to them? I probably would say have a plan, like know what you're trying to accomplish before you just start. Because uh, it, it's um, kind of a rabbit hole. There's a lot of really cool features in there. And if you're not sort of intentional in what you're doing, you could get lost and go, oh, I want to do this. I'm going to try that. I'm going to try this and try that. And you're going to spin your wheels a lot and not really get what you want out of it. So I went into it very, um, very intentional. And I've, I have actually shifted my focus a little bit um, the way I use Pictory. But I love the fact that there's kind of those four main ways that you can interact with it. And it's uh, it's been very helpful. Well, that's great. You've been very generous with your time this morning. And I thank you very much for joining me. Absolutely. Thank you.